Daniel Arcus here. We're about to check out the Dead Zone Rogue demo. The saying it's a spacefaring roguelite with a ton of action and loot. It sounds the type of game that I would love to play. I've been looking for like a roguelike FPS games. So let's see if it's worth my time. Let's go. Docking with the colony ship. Here we go. We just get dropped right into the game and we start inside the spaceship. Ooh, the gunplay feels pretty good. Oh, I think I can see all the weapons we can get here. Pretty cool. Select a security level. Oh, so here we we're going to be able to pick like the uh, challenge level difficulty. So we have adventure and challenging. Relaxed gameplay experience, challenging gameplay experience. We got a complete successful run to unlock extreme difficulty. Oh, so I think I'm going to do a adventure run. Try to play chill. See how it goes. Stealth mode activated. Oh, it can be in stealth. I don't play with stealth mode. Ooh. Oh, we're killing all the robots. So you get loot, get scrap and tech. And I think we got our first item. Greaves, common legs. 1.3% critical hit chance. Awesome. So with the tab, we can go to the inventory. And it looks like it put it on automatically. Because we didn't have anything on that slot. So we also have some kind of upgrades here. We have a full defense, attack, utility, full on talent tree, which is cool. I don't know if you need to ADS to hit the targets. Probably not. Yeah, I think the gun is accurate even when shooting from the hip. So I think th this is going to be our primary weapon. So it looks like it's an ice weapon. Shatter. 2.4% chance to hit the shatter. Nice. Highly accurate semi-automatic rifle. And we also got a helmet, which will add us protection. We get shield recharge speed from that. Great. So you can swap weapons with Q. Oh, it's like a single shot rifle. Okay. Takes a while to reload. At least you don't have to deal with like running out of ammo. It looks like the ammo is unlimited. I don't think this gun is fully accurate unless you scope with it. Oh, we got so much loot here. Let's go. So I don't know if there's an inventory. I don't think so. You can only wear like one piece each. So you have to kind of check when you pick them up. Let's get the crit chance gloves. There we go. We got a 6.7% critical hit chance. Not too bad. Ah, here we go. We got a tech synthesizer. So it looks like this kind of some kind of permanent upgrade. More tech pickup, more primary damage or shield recharge rate. I think I'm going to get the primary damage. Let's max that out. Could probably increase this one too. So we get more pickups. And here we get it to roll like the uh, kind of like a round based chances, I think. Targets within 10 meters of have their movement reduced 50% when damage. That's really good. 50% more damage to enemies with chill stack. I actually have a chill weapon. So this might be really nice for me. Let's pick that up. And weapon fabricator. So we can buy a weapon here. Ooh, it's like an ice pistol. Let me just look uh, buff on ice. I'm gonna buy it. That's great. So we got two ice weapons now. Oh, I like this gun. It's a burst. Is that better? Yeah, it's better boots. Let's pick it up. I really like this pistol. Is that a blue? It is. So you got a blue gloves. 9.8% cooldown reduction. That sounds very good. But what cooldown are we reducing? I'm not sure yet. Try to get the headshots. Oh, there was a dude behind me. That was close. I nearly got hit. I like that the music changes when you're like done with the level. It's a nice touch. Oh, it's spiders. Oh, the grenade is on uh, cooldown. So I guess the cooldown reductions are for the grenade. That would make sense. So I think now we can go to the uh, buy room finally. So we can keep on synthesizing. Oh, I like the magnetic. But I think we gotta go for the scrap pickup. So then we can boost more. Oh, we have some green guns here. We got another sidearm with the freeze. This is the only like main. I could reroll here. Unlucky. I could do another one. Ooh, okay. Yeah, we're definitely buying that one. Get a blue gun as a primary. That looks like some kind of boss. Oh no. I'm trying to freeze it. There we go. Got him. Okay, that was good. We got a blue helmet from a new grenade. I think we just got full blue set. A movement speed. Yes, please. The only thing we're missing is blue chest plate and our common sidearm. What? There's like a thingy again. Sprint speed. Ooh, 20% health sounds pretty good. Let's go for that one. 
can pick another augmentation. Burn those 25% more damage. Sure. Energy Axe. That's a pretty nice pistol upgrade. Let's get it. So we're looking for a control room here. This gun doesn't feel very accurate. At least if you're not ADSing with it. Oh, I think I lost my shield. Oh, I'm losing some health here. Jeez, these guys are pretty tough. I was playing the easy mode. They drop a lot of loot for you. It's crazy. I want to get a perk that reloads when you put the gun away. That would be so good. Oh, that's a freeze grenade. Hey, there we go. Now we are full blue, except the melee weapon. You gotta find a better melee weapon for sure. This feels like some kind of boss room here. And the flying thing is hurting me. Gotta kill that. Hey, we found a blue dagger. It's an 18.3% chance to hit and create a singularity. With the enemy location pulling. Oh, it does like a black hole. Sweet. Ooh, all weapon damage. I kind of like the grenade stacks too. That's pretty nice. Let's get that. And then we can get the uh, damage upgrade. Prevents a kill shot, leaving you at 5% health. Oh, that's very good. Don't like that. Killing an enemy with the grenade spawns another grenade on their corpse. I'm gonna take second wind. Because that prevents me from dying, which is really nice. That looks like a rifle. I have a pretty good primary gun, I think. So we don't need to buy one right now. Okay, those spiders blow up in your legs. I have to kill them before they hit me. Ooh! Oh crap, I'm so low. I'm dead. What killed me? I thought I got a second wind. Okay. Well, that was my first run, I guess. We're gonna do another run because I died. So we got 160 HP now. So I bought quite a few HP upgrades for myself. We got a bit of an argument choice again. I think we're gonna go shatter damage is doubled. I think that's really good for now. We're gonna find all the frozen weapons. Uh, we don't need to buy anything in this run on the first room. We can find better stuff. And the shatter is so good. We got like a full green set. Or full blue set from the boss. Pretty good. Reloading your weapon grants you 30% movement speed for 2 seconds. That's pretty good. Your next shot after dashing does get this one. Nothing good in the weapons there. We got a new weapon drop. It's a sniper. I don't like it. It's too slow. Oh! We nearly died already. That was close. My weapon is pretty bad for this run. So I think we might die. I need some heals so bad. You get healed every time you go to, you go into these like buy rooms. That's kind of nice. Let's go full on like frozen build. Uh, I think I might get this one. It seems like a good sidearm. It's like a revolver. Yep. So much damage with this. Get all the purple items and we should be good. Yeah, we're only missing purple gloves and we're done with that. Oh, that's pretty nice. Okay. It should be good now. Spider-Man. Spider. It's a freaking legendary shotgun. I guess we take it. Don't like it, but that's okay. It's a good weapon though. The burn it puts is pretty insane. A fire trail. Yeah. It takes forever to reload a shotgun. That's kind of the problem with it. I'm already hating these flying things. So hard to dodge their attacks. Have to hide behind the pillars. Oh shit. Oh. I'm so dead. Yeah, I really just could have played more carefully. Like, try to avoid. What's that? Oh, it's another shotgun. Me. I think we need more primary damage. We're kind of lacking. 
3% health, max health back after killing enemy with the melee. That's really nice. That's also really nice. To get this one. I don't feel like I killed them that many times with the melee. Chain lightning weapon. SMG. I think I might get this one. Just to try it out. Oh shit. This is bad. I'm dead. Again. Damn it. Okay, this time I have a pretty good weapons. I have like lightning weapons. Try to kill this big boy. Oh. I got the big boy. I have to kill the flying ones. This pistol is pretty good against the uh, the flying pieces of crap. I got him. I gotta be more careful with the uh, with the room, with less space. I think this might be the run for me. I'm doing so well so far. Maybe I talk too soon. Oh no. Okay, we're good now. Uh, you should probably go more damage on this one. Because I use the secondary quite a bit. Let's go for the chain lightning. Damn it. Unlucky. I'm gonna get the grenade though. I'm stuck. Oh, we killed the big boy. That was good. There's another one. Shit. We killed it. Ooh. The legendary boots from that. Pretty good. Stat. Electric grenade. Sure. Okay, that was a mistake. It was definitely a mistake. Oh, shit. I'm running away. I think I'm doing it. Oh, I nearly lost it there. That was close. The shield guys are so annoying. Got him. I think this is the furthest I've been so far. Fire damage. Now we need the healing orb. Max that out. Do a reroll. Nothing good. And nothing good. I mean, I guess I could swap to this one. Christ, what is that? Oh, this is the final boss. I'm pretty sure. Holy shit. Whoa. Okay. That was brutal. Just killed me. There we have it. Dead Zone Rogue demo. Honestly, the demo gives you quite a bit. I've always wanted to play like an FPS roguelite game. And this seems to hit the spot for me quite well. You don't get to unlock a lot of stuff in the demo, but it gives you the general idea how the game is going to be. And it's pretty difficult already on the lowest uh, difficulty. I was struggling a little bit, but I did get through it at the end. Definitely a game I'm probably going to buy and play a little bit more. Hopefully they have some items that have like special perks and stuff. I could definitely see that happening. But yeah, tell me in the comments. What do you think about Dead Zone Rogue? Are you a fan of roguelite FPS games? Give this video a like, subscribe to my channel, it really helps me out. Thanks for watching, I hope to see you in the next one. Have a good one, take care, bye bye.